Leo, welcome to your career in finance reading for January 2021. This is Y. Crotero, and my name is Ebony. If anything in this message does resonate with you, be sure to leave this video a like. It really helps with the circulation of the videos to be seen by more people, and it is the easiest and freest way that you can help to contribute to the channel. And to, when you extend your good energy to me, I in turn give back to you, and I am truly, truly grateful. All right, Leo. Let's go. So, starting off, mm, mm, mm. we have the tower. The tower. Scorpionic energy dealing with this, maybe dealing with the Scorpio. Towers come in to bring you off in a new direction. Send you off in a new direction, possibly ending a job, possibly beginning a new job. Again, the tower is about contrast. Coming in to show you what you don't want so that you can start to put your sights and efforts on what you do want to change your focus to change your perception okay some of you are definitely changing job opportunities or a job could have just ended for you a new career path you're going off know this the tower has come in for a good reason when i see the tower in the upright this is a good sign because the universe is literally coming in to push you in your true direction it's removing any obstacles, any barriers in your path that are no longer serving you so that you can go off in your true direction. Good. Your strength, Leo. I like to see this. Right now, Five of Cups in reverse, looking at what has not worked out for you. All these broken cups on the ground. You're letting that go. Letting go what's no longer serving you. Letting go, looking at maybe what you felt like you were holding on to because again a tower comes in that's your whole foundation that's your whole world you're willing to let it go though because you understand that it's not serving you okay is there loss is there a sense of loss if you are changing jobs if it's something you put all your time and effort into quite frankly if there's a sense of disappointment you are coming out of it because you see the truth of the matter i like that energy for you a lot in this position i do i really do your weakness leo nine of swords in reverse sleepless nights some of you are up late at night because you're working on it you're working on going in this new direction you're not sleeping i want to tell you it's giving you anxiety it is in reverse for you though so you're again you're coming out of this cycle okay some of you, if you've experienced job loss, I want to tell you to expect uh, there's a shift coming to you. I'm just sensing either communication. You could be hearing something. Um, I don't like to go by the card sometimes, but I did feel an energy. Expect something maybe within the next two weeks. You might get some clarity or get get um within nine days i want to say that's vague and i don't like to give that but i did feel the energy from the card as soon as i said it so maybe you're going to hear something in the next nine nine to ten days i want to say okay get you out of this can't sleep at night energy we don't like it all right obstacles things you're not maybe aware of <laughs> your own victory honey six of wands it feels right now like you're running a marathon. I know. <laughs> it feels like you've been going and going and going. But know this, the victory is yours. The success is yours. The obstacle is perceiving it in your own mind first. You're getting that clarity. Some of you could be in athletics. That's not, I don't necessarily want to just assume that whenever, just because I see a runner here featured in this card. To me, it mostly feels like, I mean, when the Six of Wands comes up, that victory is well earned. It's, some of you are actually getting rewarded and recognized for your hard work. Again, maybe why this tower moment had to happen for you. You're getting recognized, and this is something you don't even see. You don't even see the recognition that's coming in for you right now. Because you've worked hard, Leo. The Six of Wands is about being lifted up. It is about victory. So know that, if nothing else, it's here for you. The outcome here. <sighs> Two of 
two of cups, honey. Some of you, a lot of you could be entrepreneurs. You work late. Uh, your entrepreneurs work uh, from home, I want to say. You could also be meeting romantic partners. I did want to say that in your through your work endeavors if you're not currently in a relationship. But know that whatever you do is going to be loved and felt with the Two of Cups energy. This is about soul bond union. Know that your next opportunity or what you're currently working on is your true life path. It is for you. It is the Two of Cups, the soul, the lovers, right? It's a fit. It's a bond. It's a match. That's what I want to tell you. Keep that coffee up if you're working late at night. I know you need that caffeine, by the way. <laughs> oh, yeah. You have a love in what you do. I feel that. I really do. Do we even need to clarify? Because honestly, this is just like beautiful but yes we will i am going to clarify for you today using the wild unknown to row let's see why that tower moment came in i am curious about it i really am i am spirit God, benevolent beings how to clarify for the best possible clear give me help give me the best possible clarification for leo regarding career and finance let's show leo what they need to know for their greater good in regards to career and finance that tower something came in and shook the world but it's leading you in a better direction if this is a job opportunity change it's leading you in a better direction okay spirit let's clarify the tower please why is that here why is the tower here please spirit jumpers please clear messages for leo clear messages here please for leo i feel you i feel you Well, this is looking lovely. The star, Aquarian energy. You're finding your true path. You're going in your true path, Leo. This is lovely. The star is in line with your true surf. You're doing what you want to do. The tower has come in to clarify it for you. Wow. <laughs> wow. The tower has literally come in to send you on your true path. Do you want to stop? We can stop. <laughs> Show me that five of cups, please, spirit. <laughs> what more do you need to know, Leo? If it hasn't happened for you, it's coming. I feel it soon. Very soon. Show me five of cups, please, spirit. Why is that here for Leo? Yeah, I feel you, I feel you, I feel you. Woo! Father of Wands. You. <laughs> Leo. And the Upright. Father of Wands. Sometimes I won't take reversals with this deck, just so you know. I just feel the energy. Your passion. You have renewed your sense of passion because you have let go of the emotions that have not that have been holding you back frankly from going off in whatever business venture you're going off in right now leo I, you're standing in your own energy male or female you are standing in this energy this is all being clarified for you you see you see your passion you got it that's why this anxiety sleepless nights and depression is in reverse for you too truth of the matter here with the mother of pentacles your stability possibly even a divine counterpart possibly oh we are trying look at that we got the mother of pentacles and the father of pentacles for those of you in marriage marriages partnerships divine counterparts you're finding your passion i'm also sensing If some of you ended a relationship that caused you to go into a direction, I am feeling that for you. It's put, and I know maybe the breakup was tough. Okay. Again, guys, this is why we read this energy and sometimes stuff comes out because I get it in the reading. Okay. Love family life directly affects career and finance. I'm seeing a father of wands and a, now I've seen a married couple on the deck, king and queen of pentacles clarifying this nine of swords 
that maybe you had to break something. Maybe something got broken. Okay. Also, I'm seeing that in you renewing your own sense of passion, you could have restored, restored your marriage, frankly. You both are upright, headed in the same direction. You know what you want. Okay. Spirit, let's clarify this victory for Leo. Why is that here, please? Six of Wands. Why is that here, please? What did you find out, Leo? Ooh, hello. Page of Wands. You got your passion back. This is lovely. Passion back for what, please? It's new. It's you found a new offer. You got a new offer. You're taking that first step. This is clarifying the victory because you had to take the first step. This tower moment again had to happen. None of this energy would be on the board for you if it didn't mean that much to you, frankly. Okay? You've ignited a passion again. You've got that spark. Whatever you're doing. Okay? What? What? Why Why that daughter of wands? Why that page of wands? What did you find? I want to know. Because this is lovely. I want to know. What would you find, Leo? What would you find? Show me, please, spirit. Why is that page of wands here? Felt you. Mm, it's a solid offer. It's moving. It's moving. Again, pages. Sons, this is a knight. Knight of Pentacles. It is moving. You are taking that first step, that solid action. It's slow, okay? The business venture that you're going on to could also be slow. I did want to say that. Or it's starting off slow. That's why I felt you're going to be hearing some news here soon. If you've been submitting those resumes, whatever you've been doing, okay? If you've been starting from scratch, it's going okay the knight of pentacles yes he is the slowest moving knight but he gets there know that you are getting there leo you're building that fire okay you're standing in your own energy you've got a renewed sense of partnership and foundation coming out of your own internal struggle about the situation frankly and i love it for you i really do i do because ahead of you this outcome the two of cups your true north the partnership in business, love, whatever. I don't even want to clarify that, but we're going to. Why is the Two of Cups here for Leo? Why'd you find this love, Leo? It's what you want to do. Go for it. You know it's what you want to do. Why is the Two of Cups here, please, Spirit, for Leo? Let's clarify. Show me clearly. Show me clearly. Why is the Two of Cups here, please? You're willing to wait, but you're moving forward. Seven of Pentacles with the chariot, because you planted a new seed, an idea. This is an entrepreneurial venture for you. You're you're prayer prepared, willing to take the time to put it in, to put in the work. Yes, it could start off slow, but you're going to be moving fast here, Leo. The chariot, you're going, and you're going for it. You're planting those seeds. You're getting. You're okay. You're starting something very new here new business venture or new idea, new project, put a name on it, put a label on it. It's new, but you're putting in the work. You're planting those seeds. Yes, you're waiting. But no, you won't be waiting for long. Okay, the chariot, ready to go. Go. Cancer energy, let me know if you're dealing with the cancer. Leo, this is stunning. I love to see this reading for you. Some of your readings have been a little, this is a lovely reading. Please let me know in the comments what's resonating for you. I want to know what you're working on. This is lovely. All right. Your healing card is rewriting the subconscious. The more I embrace feeling good, the less often I will feel bad. The more I embrace feeling good, the more you feel good. The more I feel good, the more I feel good. Say that to yourself. I feel good. Why do I feel good? It's lovely. The more I feel good, I feel good. Give yourself that positive vibe up shift, Leo. Say, look in every moment of your day for what is serving you. And just give your love to it. Show it your love. Show it and acknowledge, I see you. I see you. I love you. I love you for that. I love you. Thank you. I found my passion. Thank you for showing me what I needed to see. The more I feel good, the more I feel good. 
The more others around me feel good. I love when everyone around me feels good. Your soul journey cards want you to know guilt. I release any beliefs that no longer assist in my soul's growth. Release it, Leah. Five of cups back here. Done. You released it. And gratitude. I am thankful for this life and the opportunities that it presents. Growth and gratitude. I am thankful for this life and the opportunities, I'd say so, that it presents. The Archangel card is, ooh, hello. Hostilities, I'm going to read this card to you. It's what your angels are wanting to make you aware of at this time. Number 26. Two and six together make eight, which is about abundance. Soul numbers for you. 83. This card shows a man raising his sword in readiness to do battle. When it comes upright, it reveals a situation where hostilities towards you are about to be or have already been engaged. The aggressive energy may be verbal or emotional, with someone in your environment being excessively critical, demanding, or hurtful. In a work or social situation, there may be a backstabbing or out-and-out -out slander going on. This is a different form. This is different from the deceit card because the hostile energies are more apparent, more overt. In fact, you may have been living with them for some time. But whether this is new or old energy, now is the time to regain control, allowing dishonoring treatment from others is an open invitation to the universe to send you more. It may feel risky, but you need to have the courage to stand up for yourself now and always. Leo, I hope this resonated with you. Thank you for coming back. We'll see you again soon. Come back very soon. Next week is sexual tarot. See you then.